Jim, I'm on the case. Biff of the Builder knows what... Here we go. <laughs> what a handbrake turn. That was fantastic. Hello guys and welcome to Giant Machines 2017 with me Biffa where we're going to get to drive some huge, huge machines. This is out on Steam soon, I'm going to put a link in the description below so you can check it out. We're going to start a brand new game, let's listen up to see what we need to do. Fortune helps the brave, White Thunder Silicon Mine. So we're going to be driving... What you see on the screen, look at the size of that piece of machinery in the middle there. It's humongous. Wow. And we've got these little trucks as well, which are good fun. Oh. Your first task is to extract the silicone so we can finish the work on the space shuttle. Unfortunately, our main machine has a, a small malfunction. Jim, I've got it. I am on the case. The previous oh. operator of the bucket wheel excavator was just fine. Yeah. I sure hope you can do better. I certainly can. Use the Thug ZM tow to get closer to the field workshop. I love a Thug ZM tow. I haven't driven one of those in years. What have we got going on in here? Well, let's jump straight into this thing here. Whoa, everything's a bit wibbly wobbly. Let's open the controls so we can see what we're doing. Take off the handbrake. Start the engine. <laughs> the handbrake wasn't even on. Okay. Let us go. Let's change the camera. I'm invisible! Oh my goodness, I'm going to be so good, you won't even know I'm here. Okay, yeah, we can do handbrake turns. That's like the first thing you try in a new truck. Okay, let's stick to the road. Wow, this is looking gorgeous, isn't it? Is that... Whoa! I guess that's a bit slippery. <laughs> what other camera views have we got? Oh, we got a low down inside. Oh, we can look around when we're in this one and drive at the same time. Look at the size of that thing! Oh, let's try and stay on the road. That thing is humongous. We are going to end up driving that. Look at it. I'm doing some work. But we've got a few things we need to do, first of all. Let's head down this dirt path down here. I'm going to do a handbrake turn at the end. So we've got to repair some... The broken oh. wires lie on the tray next to the tank. Try to restore them using the workbench. Jim, I'm on the case. Biff of the Builder knows what... Here we go. <laughs> what a handbrake turn. That was fantastic. Uh, let's get out. Okay, we need to find some broken wires. I'm, so I'm on my own in the middle of nowhere. Nobody is here. Let's pick these up. Take these over to here. Let's repair these. And while I'm repairing them with my hands behind my back, we can take a look around. Oh, I can only repair arms stood there. Okay. <laughs> Loving the cargo net. This is looking cool. I'm, oh, here we go. We've repaired. Well done. I see you're doing great. Cheers, Jim. Hey, try not to die while you're attaching the wires to the actuator 100 meters above the ground. Okay, I shall do my best, Jim. Wow. How the monkeys am I supposed to get up there? I'm taking the... Huh? I want to get in. Have I still got the wires or is it like... It's like dropping them on the floor. Okay, we can't drive and carry wires at the same time. Let's skip over here. La, 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 la. So glad nobody else is around here because that would look a bit weird. Okay. Oh man, this is high. Heights are not one of my favourite things. We're getting up high. Let's go this way. I'm going to follow my nose. Oh, let's go up here. <laughs> let's let's go up this one. <laughs> Walk sideways up the other one. How the heck do I get up there? Okay, there seems to be like guard railings and things around most of it, but every now and again there's like a gap you could fall down, so we've got to be careful. Let's not let's try and not die. He says don't die, so I believe you can die. Let's uh, head up here. Oh my goodness. Okay, I can't walk off the railing. It's not going to auto step me over the top, so that's good. I seem to be not going the way I need to go. Let's jump. Ooh. I wonder if I could jump over the railing by mistake. Yeah, that seems to be the one over there, doesn't it? Let's... Oh, there we go. Mm -hmm. Let's try this one instead. Because what would happen if you fell and injured yourself here? Oh, here we go. Oh my goodness. Can I... I can look around while I'm on here. Wow. So he mentioned we're getting silicon 
for to repair the space shuttle. I wonder whether at some point we're going to be able to drive the space shuttle or something. I mean, that would be humongous, wouldn't it? But even the machines that move the space shuttle around. I mean, the size of this thing. Look how long it's taken me to get to the top. Oh, my goodness. We're going to have a look around when we get to the top of this. But imagine if I fell and injured myself here in the middle of... No. Ooh, I thought it was falling then. Oh! Fits like a glove. Yay! Our next step requires starting the electromechanical transformers. Yep. Go to the main platform and turn them on. Bob, I'm your man. Jim, I'm your man. Bob was my last boss. Okay, let's walk backwards and press W to go down. <gasps> cool, good grief. <laughs> look around, look at look at how high we are. Oh, my heart's in my mouth. I mean <laughs> it's weird. I know it's not real. My brain's a bit like are you sure you're not 100 metres above the ground on a tiny ladder? Do people really climb up ladders like this with, like, no safety harnesses? They must have some stuff that they clip themselves on with or something. Surely, if you work on machines like this, let me know in the comments below. Have you ever... I knocked my mouse. Have you ever fallen to your death? What was it like? No, obviously, not good fun. Uh, let's... Oh, there we go. It sort of drops you out on the edge and then it moves you. Okay, that's fine. So let's go around here. No, let's go around here. Oh, there we go. It's saying something. E. I'm holding E. Am I maybe round the wrong side and it's going to make me do it here? Oh, here we go. Look. Oh, look. Things are moving. Aha! Have they got to go all the way down? No, nope. should we try all the way up? I'm wondering whether it's the middle button. <laughs> I don't know what these do. I think it is the middle button, isn't it? Let's let's do the middle button. This giant requires oh. proper cooling. Turn on the two main fans using the lever on the back bridge. Jim, I'm on it. Two main fans using the lever on the back bridge. Okay, let's go around there. I don't want to jump over there, so let's let's run around. Don't want to injure nothing. Oh, we're running. Oh, uh, can I squeeze through here? Can I jump over there? No, I can't. How do I get there, then? <gasps> oh, no, I don't want to go down there. Let's go around. Aha, here we go. We can check out the back end of the silicon mine. Whoa. Okay, I think we have to go down and around, so let's do that. 25 metres, we're heading the right way. Oh, here we go, here we go. This will be it, I bet. Yep, let's go up here. Yeah! Right, so let's fix the fans. Okay, and I think there was another one, was there? Yes, there was. Is that here as well? Yes, it is. Nice, nice. Whoa. <coughs> All systems are up Dust in the and face. running. Go to the driver's <gasps> cabin, start the bucket wheel excavator, and take it to the silicone excavator. He just says it like, yeah, start the bucket wheel excavator. No problem. I mean, this. look at it. Look at the size of it. So where is the um, 31 meters that way? So is that on this level? Is that down, it's down there somewhere? Okay, let's go down. I can't believe they're going to let me drive. There it is. I can't believe they're going to let me drive this thing. I mean, look. What's that? I don't know what that does. I'm not going to start fiddling with things. Oh, we're in. Right. Oh, my goodness. We are actually driving. Oh, my goodness. We are actually going to be driving this thing. Look at the size of it. Oh, that's funny. The camera, you can actually hit your head as the camera to duck underneath. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, let's... Oh, and that's the front end of it. Look. Wow. I want to be in that bit. <laughs> I bet we'll get into that bit in a minute once we've got it in the right place. Okay, so... Engine. Ah, oh, there. That's where we're going to. Okay. Let's turn off the radio. 
Right, let's see if we can get a good camera view. There we go. Is that the best one? Probably this one. Don't seem to be able to move. Oh, free camera. There we go. That's probably better. Can we... Oh, we're in neutral. Release the handbrake. Is that space again? Handbrake? Space, yeah. Oh, my goodness. I don't think I'm going to be trying to do handbrake turns in this thing. Look at the size of it. Is there, like, a gear? Can I change gear? Is it, like, one gear? No, it's one gear. Oh, look. <laughs> don't want to whack the wall with that, do you? Oh, here we go. We've reached the top speed of 2.5 kilometres an hour. <laughs> I just can't believe driving something this big. Good grief. Surely in real life, people that do this, there must be like a team of them. Rather than just, you know, Biff of the Builder on his own, in the middle of nowhere. Wondering what the heck's going on. Oh, here we go, look. How am, I, how am I doing for lining this up? Oh, we reached a top speed of three kilometres an hour there. Oh, if you turn, you see I seem to reach a slightly faster speed. I'm trying to sort of judge. I don't know how accurate we need to be into here. While I'm driving this, I'm going to reach over. Oh, where's my tea? There's my tea in a plastic bottle. Can't have anything too dangerous here. I've got a sip of that. Lovely. Lovely, nice, warm tea. 46 metres to go. We're almost there. What is the biggest thing you've ever driven? I'll tell you what the best thing was that I ever drove was when I used to work in a sports shop many, 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 many years ago. One of my bosses had an American muscle car as his car and he asked me to go and park it for him. Um, I, I assume at the time I was fully insured for doing so and I drove it around the town centre where the shop was and it was absolutely it was unbelievable the noise, the speed I mean I had to be careful obviously I wasn't like breaking the speed limit but there was some there was a nice ring road with a nice uh, nice sort of loop Jim's going to kick in in a minute isn't he and tell me to do something oh man that is like perfect that is like perfect and it was an amazing machine to drive. It was absolutely amazing. Look at that. I couldn't have done that more perfect if I tried. Two, one, stop. Good work. Thank you. We can start mining tomorrow. Okay. Mission complete. Yay, we've done the bucket excavator. I'm a rocket man. Okay, next mission. Silicon Valley. Right, oh. The bucket wheel excavator is operational now. So we can start extracting the silicone ore and filling our containers with it. Oh, nice. Start the whole truck and take it to the unloading site of the bucket wheel excavator. Okay. Remember to monitor the hydraulic pressure levels. Going over the allowed maximum value will result in an emergency shutdown of the machine. Aha. Uh -huh. You'll have to exit the machine and reset the fuses. Right, okay. So let's go and have a look at our haul truck. Oh, this is huge. This is huge. Look at this thing. It's a Lieber S141P. Imagine the size of the garage you would... Oh, can I drive this? Oh, I thought that was a, a thing allowing me to get on. Oh, that's a shame. It's like a ladder to get up into your car to drive it. That's how big it is. Look at the size of this thing. I'm assuming... It, where's the fuse is going to be? Ah, oh, these things here. There we go, look. That's the fuses. They're all okay. So let's enter this. Let's see how we go. Is that water dripping? Let's... Ah, oh, here we go. Right, so where are we going to? Yep, we started. What other camera view have we got? We've got a low one. We've got the inside. We've got this one. Let's use this one. Take off the handbrake. 779 metres. Not quite sure where I'm going. Over there somewhere. Can I turn this one all the way? Oh, wow, it turns on a sixpence. Look at that. The exhaust coming out of this thing. Okay, here we go. Let's let's head round here. I will try and do a handbrake turn on this once we've got into maybe a bit of open space. So I'm not going to, like, hit and... 
<laughs> oh, he's even got the beeping. There we go. Oh, I see it's got the load, the pressure indicators on them. Okay, yeah, on the side. Check the controls in case it's... Oh, we can... Pressure? Well, I don't know what that does. Oh, look, we can lift that up and down. Okay, that's fine. Yep, yeah, we've got the controls. Let's try and carefully drive through here without crashing into anything. I wonder if I could do it with this view. Oh my goodness me, that view is very difficult. Yeah, I'm changing back to this view. That's... We're swinging it round. Oh no! Sorry, boss. Come on. Oh, it's so slow when it's going backwards. Okay, that should be enough. Let's go around there. Watch the wheel. Got it. What I don't want to do is get stuck. <laughs> Irretrievably. But then I might have to call in the biggest AA, or I don't know what you call that in America. You know, car rescue tow truck ever known to... Right, we're going to try a handbrake turn. Yeah, okay. It doesn't really do anything. It was skidding already. Let's just try and keep this thing calm. Okay, we're heading over there. The road's not even big enough to hold this thing. Look at it. I don't want to go in the middle there. Let's... Ooh. I'm just going to slow, slow down a bit. <laughs> Good grief. You could cause some devastation in this thing, couldn't you? Can you imagine? Okay, here we go. We're heading up to this big thing here. We want to line this up. I'm assuming that we're going to start mining some stuff. And it's going to chuck it in the back of this. So that's going to be the plan. So we've got to line it up here at the off-ramp, at the offshoot, whatever it would be called, where the stuff comes out. Here it is, look. So we want to, we want to line that up there, look. No, I'm turning the wrong way. Let's try that again. Let's go forward. There we go. This will be good. This will be good. Not quite as straight as I would like it. Let's just try that once more. Okay, that should be good now. Oh, there we go. Look, let's do it that way. Perfect. Stop. Now we can yeah. start digging for real. <gasps> Enter the operator's Stop. cabin of the bucket wheel excavator and start the engine. Okay, let's go. Oh, let's not fall down and die. So we want to get up and over there. Is that looking like it's in the right place to you? Yep, it is. Right, okay, let's get up. Here we go. Let's skip over there. La, 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 la. Here we go. I'm not going to skip up the stairs. I'm going to take safety seriously. It didn't get me to put a hard hat on or anything, did it? Uh, I can't remember how to get there. It's been a while. I think it's on this... Oh! What? How on earth do I get over there? I must walk along here somewhere. This isn't the bit I was in before, is it? Okay, let's go up to the next level. I'm like drunk, staggering from the side. Oh, here we go. This is it. Oh my goodness me. La la la. <laughs> Listen to his footsteps. He's skipping. I know he is. He loves his job so much. Aha, here we go. Right, we are going to be working that big thing over there, aren't we? Okay, start the engine X. Yes. Start the wheel and begin gathering the ore. But be careful now. To minimize ore loss, peel off relatively small layers of soil at a time. Right, okay. So let's just look at the controls here. Camera, headlights, headlights? Oh yeah, okay. Headlights on this thing, we don't really need those. Jib up, jib down. Wheel on, wheel off. Oh my goodness, they see me rolling! Oh, yeah. Jib up, jib down. How do I go forward? 
that's that up and down. Let's, let's go along. Oh my goodness. Okay, can't move at that camera view. That camera view's too far away. Okay, let's just do this then. Oh, it's going in. Are we collecting anything? Yes! What? 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 What's the emergency for? Ten tons out of a thousand. Ah! Uh, what? Oh dear. Start the wheel and begin. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> Not quite sure what I did wrong there, but let's start the engine. Okay, it says handbrake, but I don't think there really is a handbrake. Let's start the wheel. Okay. Good, good, good. Let's move to the right. And just see what happens. I mean, you can, you can move up and down, you can move left and right. That's about the only thing you can do. You can't move into or away from the face, so... Right, let's just see what's going on here. It's digging in. Oh, it's like it wants me to get to that point there. Look. 128 metres away. See, that looks like it's going in. It's not actually collecting anything. Okay, we've got one, two, three. This might take a while. Oh, there we go. It seems to be working quite well now. I'm just sort of randomly moving around this terrain. Doesn't seem to be getting the errors that we had before. Oh, here we go. We're getting loads pouring in now. Oh, excellent. Oh, you can see it all running down there. The FPS is horrendous with this running. But look at all the bits moving down the conveyor belt. We're almost there. We're almost there. It's going to do it. Yay! Let's stop the engine. Enough raw ore. It was automatically converted to the production quality silicone. Nice. Go on down to the unloading shaft and fill the whole truck up with the material. Excellent. Thank you, Jim. Put the handbrake on. Look at that. We've actually deformed the terrain there. Fantastic. Uh, let's exit this thing here. Okay, we need to head over there. Let's run along here. And I just fell off and died. Ah! Darn it! And the last checkpoint is going to be... Hopefully after I've collected all the ore. Yes! Thank goodness for that. Right, here we go. Let's turn this on. Oh. Oh, we've got to hold it while it fills up. Oh, there we go. It's all flying in. So let's hope... What's it say on the side there? 20... I think that's the... Is that how much we're holding? That little red figure that's down there on the truck? Possibly it is. Because it's matching the same as the one at the top there. So we want 275 tonnes. Oh, it's all flying out. Nice, nice. Almost there. 260, 270. Go 275. Back to the truck and transport the ore to the container. Oh, and there's more going in. 293. Oh, dear. So I don't know how that's going to affect how this thing runs. Okay, let's go back. We've got to take this to the container and hopefully, I think the idea is going to be that we don't end up spilling it and losing it. It seems to be that there's a checkpoint every time this guy speaks, so that's good. I'm pleased about that. Here we go. Oh my goodness, I think the game is rendering each individual piece of ore in, in, in a not very... FPS conducive way. I have above the minimum. Uh, I have above the maximum spec that this game needs you to have. There we go. Is that handbrake on or off? Off. There we go. Let's have a look. Okay. Look. This is what we've got. Oh, we want to be careful here. Let's look at the sides. Two ninety seven. We've got a lot. Where are we going to? Let's see. All the way over there. Right, let's see if we can do this without losing any of this stuff on the way. I hope so. Otherwise, I'm going to have to do it all again. Yeah, there's no crashing, tipping around, 
tipping over, handbrake slides. <laughs> this time, come on now. Bit for the builder, let's get this done. Right, here we go. We've got to load this into there. So, let's see how this goes. Uh, let's change my camera view. There we go. Something I've noticed about the camera view. If you set your camera view on the freeform, say to this, then you've got the first camera view is inside. The second one... Oh, the second one was generally... Oh, well, forget that. No, I thought the camera view did something particular. It doesn't. Right, let's... All right, let's back this bad boy up. There we go. I used to drive with a trailer on the back of my, my truck for one of the jobs I've had, so lining these things up shouldn't be too difficult. So let's take a look. Oh yeah, we need to go back a bit more. Perfect. So let's see if we can get this out and it not... Right, let's go forward a bit. Handbrake. There we go. Let's get that to roll in. I don't want it all to come flying out the back and disappear over the end and we have to do it again. Here it comes! Here it comes! Oh yeah, I think we're going to be fine. Look at that. It's actually bouncing the truck. It's so heavy. I love it. Yay! I think this will be good. Oh, it's going to start filling up. Oh, 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 oh. I'm going to move forward a tiny bit. And break. Get this evenly spread out. There we go. That should be fine. It's all going in. 250. Well, with that enthusiasm, I'm sure we'll get along splendidly. Indeed, Jim. Mission complete. Hooray. We've gathered a container full of silicon. Oh, now we're going to be moving on to this one here. After each workday, the silicone containers must be properly stored. Okay. Let's take a look. We use the mobile crane to move the containers. Park the machine in the designated area. As always, you can use the Thug ZM tow to get to the machine park faster. Excellent. So we're going to have a fun with a mobile crane. There it is all the way over there. There's our Thug. Oh, what's this? Can I just nip in here before we go? We can't. We have no time. Let's skip. Let's skip to the Thug. Woohoo! Come on, buddy! Let's go. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, handbrake, engine. And we're off. Whoa, whoa. Okay, let's let's try not to crash this thing. Whoa, this is this slippers and slides. I love it. Yes, I know. I like putting the handbrake up. Right, let's <laughs> let's try and get over to this thing in one piece. What's that? I've got an achievement. Holiday in Cambodia. What? I don't know what that does. Okay. Maybe that's where we are. I don't know. Is this Cambodian silicon mines or something? Maybe. Okay. Let's head on over to the crane. And give this bad boy a try. Aha! Here we are. This seems like it. Oh, there's like some real big trucks parked in here. There it is. Right. Let's park the thugsy out the way. Oh, turn off the engine. Out we get. Wow, look at this thing. Oh my goodness, this thing looks huge. Let's jump into here. What have we got here? Engine cam. Okay, it's not telling us about any of the... Okay, we've started it. Are we going just down here? Oh my goodness, look at this thing. Look at this thing! Oh my goodness, what the heck? Talk about a tight turn. Oh, I've made it! I've made it round the corner. This thing is humongous, look at it! Good gravy. Come on, let's get down here. Let's... Oh, let's lift with this thing. Oh, we've got to park it in there. Look, there's a spot, I think, to park it. Yep. Yeah. So let's get it in here. First time. No messing. Come on, Biffa. The builder. We can do it. Oh my goodness, the perfection. Two. One. Come on. Oh, lovely. I don't want to release the handbrake. We're stopping right there. 
Yes. Get into the operator cabin of the mobile crane and fully spread it. Pardon? Oh, it's at the back here. Okay. Spread the crane, I see. Right, let's do that. How do I get up there? Is it like a ladder? There is. Let's jump in here. So is there going to be... Fold, unfold and fold. So I'm guessing it's going to be T. Let's have a look at the... Oh, let's start the engine. Ah, oh, there we go. Look. Oh, look. Is that what I've got to do? Oh, yeah, look. Let's go back inside. I'm all up in the air and can't see what's going on. <laughs> okay, let's, let's keep unfolding this. It's got one each side. Yeah. Oh, I see. Look, onto the pads that are there. That makes perfect sense. And the little legs are going down. Oh, he's lifting us up. We're going now up. Now you can use the crane to move the four containers to their destinations. Mm -mm -mm. Excellent. Right. Well, we're going to take a pause there. We're going to pick up those containers and we're going to move them over there, I'd imagine. Oh, my goodness me. We're going to look forward to doing that tomorrow. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like. So I know that you're enjoying this series and I will make some more. Well, there's going to be a couple more anyway because I'm having great fun. So tune in the same time tomorrow. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you're new to my channel. That is always greatly appreciated. And I'll see you tomorrow for some more giant machines. Take care. Bye-bye.